Right. So now that we have Notepad++ open, let's write a Hey Buddy program. Okay. The first thing we're going to do, Brian, is we'll save the file. Okay. All right. So we'll we'll just do file, save as, of course. And we'll just kind of, I don't know, you want to jump on the desktop. Sure. And we'll just make a directory here. And we'll just call it like, uh, C programming. Beautiful. Beautiful. C that way, programming. all your C programming is in one spot. And what are we going to name this beautiful file, Brian? How about heybuddy.c? .c. And the beauty of Notepad++ is just by simply adding that .c extension, we have syntax highlighting for the C language. Mm. But let's just say this was Objective-C and you wanted to give it a .c file. If you wanted to go to language, you can select whatever C language you want. I don't see Objective-C in here. <laughs> but um, there it is, Objective-C. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Let me go back to C. Sorry about that. Now let's create a Hey Buddy program. Okay. Now we're going to just write a quick program to test to make sure that the compiler is running, yep. everything's fine. Don't yep. worry too much about this. Yeah, just ignore the code because we're going to explain this in the, in the upcoming video. First, we want to include our standard I.O. library. Yes. Standard I.O. header file. Yes. That will allow us to print to the console and mm -hmm. some other things. Yeah, a bunch of fun stuff. And then we want to declare our main function. Yes. That will be int main. Wow. P? <laughs> curly brace, curly brace. Now see how when you, you close the curly brace, it highlights it red? Oh, yeah. It's kind of cool. Notepad++ plus plus yes. is gorgeous. Now when you have, uh, that doesn't seem like a big deal, but when you have yeah. five million curly braces, <laughs> that's very nice. Absolutely. And the, the, the only base thing that we have to do is just return zero to the operating system when we're done. Yeah, this is this, the... This is the core, basic, yeah. minimal shell, uh, actually... Without this line, that this would be the core of <laughs> the But uh, for but that, our purposes... Yeah, we're, we're right now, we're going to just print to the user. We're going to print yeah. to you. We're going to say hi by calling the print format function. Yes. So we'll print to the screen. Hey, buddy. Hey, booty. Buddy. There we go. Hey, buddy. <laughs> hey, buddy. Give us, a, give us a new line at the end. Okay. Wow. So we actually have a program here that we nice. can run. That's beautiful. And, and we'll so, save it. Sometimes a C compiler will yell at you if you don't have a new line at the end of the file. So it's always good practice to just add a, a just a blank new line, even if you're not going to use it. Just have one extra line at the end. Okay, so let's see if this works. Oh, I'm sorry. Right, where's the, there, there it is. Go. Brian forgot how to use the computer for, <laughs> for a second. So as you remember, we left off here. We'll go to the desktop here. And we'll just pop into our C programming directory. Beautiful. Now, Brian, now that we have our HeyBuddy.C program, let's compile it and run it. Okay. So we want to call GCC. Yeah. And then we do something crazy like uh -huh. the file we want to compile. Uh huh. And we could specify the output file. Ooh. We can say HeyBuddy.exe. Dot .exe. Oh my goodness! Hit it, oh, Brian. Buddy. We have an executable file. Let's list that directory. <gasps> oh, hey buddy. C. Look how much larger yeah. look how, how, look how large it is compared to the uh, that's not actually large it's just in in bytes it's very small but <laughs> still it's still much larger than it's, now it has than it's the, text now it has standard IO in there <laughs> right all right well let's kick it off and see what happens hey, hey buddy, buddy. Hey. so that that goes to show that we we're able to compile Notepad++ is great. Mm -hmm. MGW is great. Yep. We're up and running. Now yep. we can basically write whatever we want. We can, right. we can write the next Photoshop now. <laughs> <laughs> so the environment is set up. So in the upcoming lab videos, we're just going to be picking up right where we left off. And then in the next video, we're going to be discussing the intricacies of Hey Buddy and compiling and all that fun stuff.